Oh my God, look at what I found last cast. Look at that. So guys, we're back in Leicester again at our favorite bridge behind us, uh, where we found uh, two guns. Dad's uh, got his magnet out already. He's super keen. So yeah, we'll see what we can find. Better zip my jacket up. You know what happened to the last t-shirt? It got destroyed. It was black as a canal, literally. Yeah. I got 10 pence. Finally, I have treasure. Impossible to get off a magnet, but... Look at the size of that! I've just found this look, it looks like a 50 caliber bullet tip. Oh, it's like the biggest bullet I've ever seen in my life. That's a big one. Jesus! <laughs> yeah, that is a That's from a brownie machine gun. Look at that! 50 brownie machine gun. Let's have that. 80. Hey, it's rifled as well, Dad. It's been fired. Don't know if you can see that. There's some very fine ridges on this bit. That means it's been fired where it's engaged with the rifling that makes it spin. It gives it stability. Oh, yeah, that is rifled and that would have been fired. I wonder if this place was heavily bombed in the World War II, Dad. That was probably fired off an aircraft. I don't know what I found, it's wrapped up in tape. We'll soon find it out. I'm gonna open this. I know what that is. What? Should I drop it? Well, what oh, no, maybe not. Look at that. Not money. Let me bring you down here. What's that? Oh. oh, bag of money. It's got a candle. Oh, look at that box. Oh, Jesus. Holy cow. Jeez. What the? What's that all about? It's got a plastic egg in it. We can see that. Another candle. Why's it got loads of candles in it? I think you've been cursed now for the rest of your life. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's more in it. There's another candle. What are they? Oh no, it's got a cross in it. Oh no. It's a bag with a crossy with beads and all that. More money, I'm happy about that. I'm not happy about the spirit stuff in it. Bloody hell, what's in it? What is it? Why has it got candles in it? This is dead creepy. Look at this. It's got a bag with a bloody sacred thing in it. It's got one. Oh, oh, Dad, it's got a crucifix on it. It's got another one in it. With a cross. The crucifix on it. This is some holy stuff. Look at this. I don't think that one will fit over my head. We potentially have a dagger. Here's the bit where it will go into like wood or plastic. There's the other end where it's sharp. Blades that side. Look at that. 
Got me another thing off a lantern, look. There's a little handle. And there's the uh, burner. And that's what I like about these. Well, it half felt a bit, but that's the remnants of it. Um, we'll give that a tap off when we get home. These things usually clean up quite well because uh, the paraffin that they used to burn with them, it kind of coats it and gives it a protective coating. So when you take the rust off, it looks really nice. So we'll uh, clean that up when we get home and I'll show you, probably insert a picture. Dad's got some money. Uh, well, some religious bag thing, I don't know. Seems to be what all these things are wrapped. I hope it's not a bag of bombs. God, this is real stuck to it. It's like a purse, Dad. All wrapped up. You want to find Look out where he's. Where you sort of give them back or. Yeah, yeah they have cards in. Look at this. Oh my God, Dad, it's full of foreign coins. It's full of foreign coins. They're not English. No, We're alright if we go to Spain. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> They're all Euro coins mixed with. Oh, wait, you have got a few English ones. Oh, it's the gold ones, eh? Oh, it's the gold ones, are one. Can I have the gold ones? No, 20 cents. <laughs> 50 cents. It's better. Made in China. <laughs> You've got two euros. Any notes, any notes in it? No notes in there, is it? What's that one? 50 cents. We'll leave your money in the purse, Dad, and leave my money in the bucket, and then we can see you find the most. George has found this. I think it's like a boat hook or a pipe gap. This one's not a very exciting one, but it's actually a handmade nail. Quite an early one, that one. It's got metal in that lot. Probably off a roofing tile. Magnetic. Look at that. A slate. Odd. Don't know what this is. Might actually be part of. Oh, hey, look at these. <laughs> oh, wow. What the hell? This is the funny one. Oh, God. <laughs> what on earth? Look what I've got for the camera lady. Oh, she'll love it. She's going to love them. Look at them. They've got diamonds in it, for God's sake. Look at them. They're probably one carat diamonds. Are these modern or are they something from the 1970s? They look, look like those. 70s. Set with jewels. They're all diamonds, mate, look. Yeah. I'm rich. You bloody did it again. What is it? Bolt up at 303. Is it? Come up a bit. No one can see it. Where is it? I've just found this. I think it's the bolt off a of 303. Where's can the rest of it? <laughs> Try and clean it up a bit. That's the bolt off a of cartridge rifle. That'd probably be a Lee Enfield. Looking at the back of that lot. Probably is off a of Lee Enfield. Look at the back of that lot. 303. Characteristic. Nice one. Lucky Dad finds another bag of money. We've got to take note where he's throwing this magnet. Yeah. It's just bag. It was me. What? It was me, not you. Yeah. Hey, look. Another bag full of. There you are, money. Tip all that out. Look at that. There's still more in the box. I'm not bothered, Dad, it's only coppers. I bet you're taking all the pound coins out, are you? No, look, it's all coppers. I just found two keys stuck together. There we go. See this? Two little keys. Okay, guys, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go up on the bridge so I can fish underneath. Where is it? That tree. There. That tree. Because that's where all the money is. Just found this cassette tape. You don't see many of these around now. 
Uh, George found one of these a while ago and he didn't recognise it, I don't think. Found two more big bags of money. Half of these have fell out. There's a lot more than that. I just found these. It looks like somebody's house keys. It's been a sad day when they lost those. I think I've just found the uh, trigger mechanism off a. Uh, Another gun. I don't know uh, what it is. I don't know whether it's a pistol or a rifle or what. But uh, it looks like some moving part of a trigger mechanism. I've just found another one of these little iron crosses. Seems to be a lot of religious things um, thrown in here. It's made of iron. I don't know whether he caught that. George has just pulled out a um, what looks like a parasol base or something. Big heavy thing. He's dropped it three times. <laughs> Got this um, weird little thing, maybe religious. It's like maybe a little church or something. And a knife blade on there. Got a gun barrel. It's like a rifle barrel. Jesus, that's heavy. I got this thing. Oh. That's beautiful. Like that. That's cast iron. That's a good one. Oh, this is now like Christmas, Dad. Is this a weight? Yeah. That's a that's a, an old weight off a weighing scale. Look. What's that like? Three pound? Yeah. It's like Christmas. This Happy. is got a couple of packages. Bring you down here. Bring you down. Okay then, I don't know if you can see this. Start unwrapping it. Uh, I think up there, yeah. Right. Yeah, moment of truth, guys. What do we have in this thing? I think I've got a whole box full of money. Oh, it is. What the hell? Box inside it. Oh, it's religious. Jeez. We've got a box with elastic bands. We'll just get rid of them. Oh my god. Get rid of all of this. That's the other package. It's like Christmas Day, look at this. Oh, he's got a pound, just fell out. Two beads. Three beads, four beads, some candles, and a lot of high denomination money. Look at that, we've got 50 peas, loads of pan coins, loads of five peas. Look, we've got all these pan coins and everything. Look, 50 peas. You get all the luck. <laughs> and even, there's a pound, look. There's another pound. Look, 50 peas. Where are you going? There. Another 50p. There's loads. Another pound lot. All that. 20p's. Another pound coin. Another 20p. Another 50p. Another pound coin. Another 20p. 
Tempe. Look at that lot. How many pounds have we got? One, two, three, four, five pound coins. Six, seven. Six, seven, and the rest. So we've got about ten quid in that bag, and all these religious beads. And then what have we got in this one? Put that to the side. We've got some candles as well. And then we've got this package. Throw all the plastic in there, mate, because I'm going yeah. to the bin. Don't chuck my beads away when I open them. Don't chuck my boxes. Oh, no. Oh, Don't no. throw the best shoe away. away. <laughs> what have we got in this one? One shoe is no good without the other unless you've got one leg. Yeah. Ugh. Phone is ringing. I cannot answer it. Find bin now, mate. Where's the bin? Cut it off. And then whole bag of money. Oh, that's a two pound coin, isn't it? God only knows. Got more beads. Somebody's pretty pretty serious about throwing all that money in the river. Jesus. What's that one? Dunno. Look at all of this. That's that's a euro. Twenty peas, look at all that. That's not that's what? a euro. One yeah. euro. Two euros. Euro. I'm rich if I go to Spain or something. That's a lot of money. That's not all of it, there's loads in there. I've opened, I've opened loads of them. Look at all of that in that bucket. There is tons of money. And you look down there and there's tons as well. Is that even legal? Biking down the footpath on them. How do I look, Dad? Is it good luck or is it bad luck? I don't know. What do I look like, Dad? <laughs> do I look good? I think we should keep that on, mate. Really? All right, guys, I'm going to keep this keep this on for the rest of the video. Put it down there. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave it on. The black probably suits me more. Right, help me get one. There's half the world's currency in there. I can't wait to cash it all in. See how much we got. We must have tons. Got some uh, on audience on the bridge, as you can see. How much was in that bag? What bag? What I just pulled out? Yeah, it had like 10, 15 quid in one box. Like a box wrapped in paper. Well, that's a channel called Magnetic G. Yeah. Yeah. This is a bit different from your usual. Uh, modern scooter. This one's made of wood. Yeah, <laughs> that's an old one. We're not sure, but we might have a mine. Look at that. It's got these weird wires going to it. If you can see that. Hope it's not a mine. I just found uh, somebody else's key again. 2p and 5 cents. I think I've got a another shotgun barrel. Um, see that? Certainly looks like a shotgun barrel. There's no telling really, it could just be a piece of pipe, but it's very good steel. Very old little padlock. And very old bike chain yeah. lock thing. We put it all on YouTube, that's that's where it's all ends up. Yeah. It's got a YouTube channel. Yeah, if you look on magnet, Magnetic G on YouTube, you see all the pictures found. Uh, this is just one for the kids that are thinking of jumping off these bridges into the water on a hot day. If you landed on this, this is about five foot long, <laughs> you'd be impaled on that. 
and that's just one of many many things that uh, end up in these rivers that are really sharp and sticking up in the water uh, just don't do it I wouldn't jump in there if I couldn't see the bottom so guys uh, we have this thing it says good Gildal Lane closed until pro no wait Gildal Lane closed till something like I don't know Monday the 13th of August or is it no Monday the 5th of August 2013 that's getting on a bit that's what are we now 2019 six years old we've got a six year old sign here so just shows you how long this stuff is in the river Got myself a flirty lee off that castle over there. As you can see, that's a 14th century castle. And here is what I found. I'm guessing that's off the castle. Cool find. I just found this. It, look, it looks to me like a, an old pocket watch. It's not the first one that's come out of here. If it is, that looks quite interesting. It's got a hinge at the back. So all this hinges up, but I can't get it to can't get it apart because it's uh, it's sea solid at the minute. It's either that or a little container for holding something. Got a boat turning round here. Look at this. Bit of a manoeuvre. Blue barge boating. Look at that. May have found this uh, in armor piercing incendiary thing. <laughs> We're not sure, but this this looks possibly like it could be an artillery shell. Maybe tip. incendiary. With a, maybe an armor piercing tip on there, very high. Um, very sharp point on that. It looks like a looks like a shell. Could be wrong. Don't know what it is really. This George has found this, which is like a fancy foot off something off a table or. in the comments please let us know stay still there you see are. that i'll turn it around it's got a little bolt there what not pretty that You like this one, everybody? What would you yeah, just found? I've got, I got McDonald's. Look at this. Full sign. It's even wired up still. <laughs> one of the illuminating ones. Who would chuck that in the river? Look at this. That's Take it home, those. Dad. Chuck it in the back of the Land Rover. What do you think? No, definitely not. No. Probably worth a fortune, that. Oh, I've got to bring it home. Got to. Oh, it's even yellow this side. Hang on. What's left of it, it would have gone this way. It's got the lights in the back, it's red down here. You're doing alright, mate. Look at that. It's got snails on it. <laughs> nice. Oh my god, look at what I found last cast. Look at that. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at that. Oh my god. That is amazing, look at that. Another one. Look at that! Oh my god, last cast, I yeah. am so lucky. Pocket pistol. Look at that! 
that's my third gun. I, that is my third, third gun I've found. Get out, what the heck. Look at that, another gun. Oh, I'm, I'm the luckiest person in the world right now. That beats your bloody 50 cal bullet. Look at that. I nice am one, amazed. That's a nice one. That, that is amazing. Best find ever.